Today we're playing some, uh, Ghost of Sushi- no wait, sorry. Today we're playing some Max Payne because I'm in Max Payne. Actually, I lied. Actually, I lied again. Actually, I lied again. Actually, I think I want to. Actually, I don't know. Maybe I don't want to. Maybe, you know, maybe I want to play Binding of Isaac for like a couple hours, you know? Because Max Payne is a good game. And I should spend more time on it, actually. You know, that would be a good idea. Maybe let's switch to, uh, let's switch to, <laughs> let's switch to, to Binding of Isaac today, because I said so. Okay, we're playing Binding of Isaac today. Ah, uh, shit, wait, okay, uh, I, this is a, okay. Alright, let's switch to Binding of Isaac. The Binding of Isaac. Repentance, my favorite game. Wait, actually, I should change the title again. Okay, I'm gonna change the title. Get out of the way. There we go. That's a good title. That's a really good title. I like that title. Okay. Wait, no, I, I don't like that title. Wait, no, I, I do like the title. Okay. 
it's an okay title. There. It's an okay title. Take a loop the loop and pull. And your shoes are looking cool. Okay. Alright, okay. Alright, 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 alright. Okay. 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 Gaming. We're gaming. We have hotkey enabled. Hotkeys enabled. Game booting up. Booting the game up now. Game is now booted up. Let's play. This game's bit- Why is this turned off? There we go. Okay. We're good. Hold on. I'm gonna- ah, Drink something. Ah. I've decided- If I'm willing- I will make sure to stream. God, if I'm willing. Okay. So... I have all these funny, wacky characters I could play. But I also need completion marks for... Lazarus is my next character. We have all the forgotten characters. He was kind of annoying to play. Lazarus, I still need to get people for. I think let's uh, let's do a warm up game. Don't give me a shit character. God damn it. Of course, you give me my least favorite character in the game. As my first character, my warm-up character. Great. Ow. Fuck off. Okay. I forget how annoying- No, I don't forget. I don't forget how annoying this character is. I never forget. I will never, ever, ever forget how frustrating it was to get the completion marks for this character. I, it's always going to live with me forever. Till the day I die. I'm going to remember playing this shitty character and suffering. And then having to suffer again with other shitty characters. I'm not looking forward to it. Lazarus is already a shit character. I can't wait to play as Eden, a tainted Eden. I'm talking about tainted Lazarus, I mean. I mean, tainted Lazarus. Tainted Eden's not gonna be fun at all. And, uh, who can forget tainted Lost, which is just basically, um, cock and ball torture. The character. Uh, it's like pulling nails out individually. Let me explain why. The character's entire design is... Oh, you'll get better items. The problem. Here. Here's the problem. You never get good items. With the character. You rarely get good items with the character. At least I do. Get out of here. Shoot. Okay. HP up. Tonsil. Okay. We want to go into these buildings because we need to get items for both of them. Lemon party. Okay, 
Hold on. And no key. No key. No key. Fuck off, fuck off, fuck off. No. My devil deal. No. My coochie. Dead. All right, maybe I should sacrifice my health to the health gods. All right, this is it. Okay. I sack. No ball sack. All right, it's over. It's over. I didn't get anything. All I got was suffering. I went to a Weezer concert and all I got was this lousy shirt. Alright. This is it. This is our moment. It's time to get our item. You don't need to see the character's health. What? Okay. There. There. Wow! Lazarus's la legs. Legs. <laughs> Sure thing! Wait. Almost. Okay. Go. Damn it. <laughs> this sucks. This character's lame. I have an idea. I don't know if this what will happen if I do this, but I'm kind of curious. Oh, I just become Lazarus. Yay! I get to play a different character! <laughs> Yay! Yay! Finally! Yay! Alright. Please don't tell me I have to go back to playing Jacob and Isaac. Ow! Ow. But my rage is building. You wouldn't like me when I'm angry. All right, this is it. Yeah. Yay, I get to play I <laughs> I get to play as this guy. Wow. Wow. I get to play as the gangster himself. Ragey. You won't like me when I'm mad. <sighs> oh my. It's not what it looks like. Mm, hammer. That's um. So Marge ca caught. Homer cheating on her. Uh, and so she pulls out a shotgun and kills him. I'm trying to start this new genre called, um, audio cinematography. 
I don't know if it'll work out or not. I'm still kind of working everything out. I need to be able to buy the rights to Toy Story. I'm gonna, I was thinking of doing like a, uh... oh God. I was doing, I was thinking of doing a tribute to Man on the Moon from like, I think it was like 19, 1900s, 1910. I forget. It, it was like, it was a silent film. And I was thinking, I, I think it would be a really fun opportunity to recreate the silent film. Um, oh, a classic silent, silent film um, is uh, Nosferatu. That's a classic silent film. Uh, we could try to reenact that um, with audio cinematography. I think that would work out just fine. Experimental build. Car battery. Yeah, I want car battery. Give me car battery. Give me, give me, give me, give me, give me. I mean, is it really that wrong that I want a car battery for Christmas? I mean. You wouldn't be mad at me, right? If I... Oh, I need to get hurt more. Hold on. Uh, not yet. Not yet. You wouldn't be mad at me if I... I don't know. Asked for... <laughs> Reroll. I didn't work. I'll try it. It's over for you. Ow. Hold on. It's over for you. It's over for you. Damn it. Oh god, he's jumping. I'm dead. It's over. It's over. Give me a better character. Isaac. Isaac. Classic Isaac. I haven't played this character in a billion years. He's a classic. Isaac. <laughs> the child of yours is not mine. You are the father. What are you talking about? It's time to come home, like you see. Proof? I gave you the DNA results. First try? Wow. Oh my god, thank you. Oh my gosh. Show on stream. Okay.
Hold on, hold on, hold on. Alright. Come on. Come on. It's okay. You can show yourself. Come on. Time to say hi to Dad. Say hi, Dad. Hello. Hello, Dad. Hello. See? All right, all right, you can, all right, you can go. It's your child. <laughs> it's time for you to, it's time for you to pay for child support. We can only live off of food stamps for so long. Shit. I, I mean, shoot. Uh. Wow. Wow. Come on. All right. What, what can I do to get you to... Okay, can you at least... Look. If I, I will, I will force the law to make you abide by my rules, okay? If you won't follow the rules, I will make sure you probably slept with other- No! No, the, the doctors said it was yours. The DNA shows. The DNA does not lie. Paying for that abomination. It, 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 she has your eyes. See? Remember that time we went to Paris together? Remember that? <laughs> A toy deficient. What are you talking about? Are you okay? Mentoy deficient. Look, she has a learning disability, and I can tell, like, I get that you can see that. But we have to be supportive, okay? Ooh, hello! Alright. Let's find the, uh, secret rooms. <laughs> Eyes have brains? Well, it's connected to your brain, silly. Oh, hello. Alright, we need money. We need money! Set me. You have no honor. Dun, 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 dun. Oh, here we go. Money. Fuck. Money. Fuck. <laughs> Why? Why does the game not want me to get the uh, a better item? Frick. 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 Why?
Grr. That's it. The claws are coming out. Because the game knows you're lying. It doesn't like it. What are you talking about? Look. Why don't you at least just take care? Why don't you take care of her? For every weekend. Okay? And you pay at least... $2,000 a month for child support. At least. So I can buy... So I can buy her... A, a new Xbox. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Are you out of your mind? No, I think that's... That's pretty legitimate. The lawyer told me... That that's an okay... That's a fair price. That's actually on the lower end. The alternative is that, you know... Is this Eternal D6? Eternal D6 is slightly better, but not really. Because there's a there's a small chance that it'll actually just re-roll the item incorrectly. Gold tears. I have greed. We love money. I think they changed the icon. I don't remember it looking like that. What's the alternative? Well, you come back. You come back home. And uh, we're a family once again. Which you refuse to be part of one because you refuse to take care of the kid. What's the alternative? Oh, now this is a menace. This is a menace move. This is a menace move. What? <laughs> and this is not my child. Well. Looks like you're gonna be- Oh my god. Stop it, game! You're killing me! <laughs> I shouldn't have picked that item up. This was the worst mistake. This is the worst mistake I've ever made. Oh god. It's normal. When will it strike again? Okay. Show me the paperwork for the DNA test results. Why would I need to do that? I mean, it's- it's real. You know it's real. That's why you're denying it. I've already showed you the paperwork. Silly, silly. God. Refusing to show the results. I've already showed you the results because You've already seen them? I don't understand your question. It doesn't make any sense. You're asking me to give you something that I've already provided you. You've even signed the documents. I think it's you that refuses uh, that the paperwork exists. I think you have some kind of weird amnesia that thinks that it doesn't exist all of a sudden. You need to show me the original ones? Why would I do that? You're not making any sense. How much did you pay the doctor? I didn't pay the doctor anything. Other than the amount of money that I had to charge for it. Uh, with insurance, of course. That I have to pay out of my pocket. Instead of taking care of our kid. The world. I just want to remind you that this child is suffering. 
because of you. Because you you decide you don't want to be a responsible parent. The document was an ENA test, not a DINA test. It was a typo. What are you talking about? What do you mean? What do you mean? I'd be responsible. F uh, I would be a responsible father if the child was actually mine. No, 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 no. You can't just change the lore. I'm the dungeon master here, not you. Really mad. No, 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 now I can shoot this through objects that are in my path of destruction. Now I can shoot through this. Look at that. You're gonna have to do another one. It also happens that your child passed the Ena test. I didn't take the Ena test. Why must you create these lies? Why are you lying? You did the wrong test. No, I didn't. I would know if the doctor somehow sent me the wrong test. I would know. Would you? How do you know it was I took that test? Were you there for some reason? Why would I be taking an Ena test in the first place? That's the real question. Did you s purposely swap out my test? Res like my literal test that I was taking because you wanted to be involved? I think the assumptions here are detrimental considering that you swapped out the papers behind my back i worked there i'm the guy who created the test yeah but i asked for a dna test so i shouldn't be the one liable i should sue you for purposely giving me the wrong test that i did not request i did not request an ena test i never said ena experimental pill Was it me? Yeah, now you're just lying. You're trying to hide responsive. You're trying to not take responsibility for your actions. Typical. Typical Ina moment. It's over. Getting the cross. <laughs> Getting the cross thing was the worst thing I could have ever done. Anyways, the mistakes have already been made. Go go do another test. I'm not taking another DNA test on stream. Holy car. You know what? I'll take something I'll take something better. I will take something better.
This will this will prove it. This will prove this will prove my innocence or not my innocence, but the DNA test results are real. Which at my hero academia character are you? Oh my god, there's so many ads. Okay, hold on. I swear I have ads blocked. Yeah, I have blocked ads on. Turn it on. Oh, you fuckers. Okay, I have a better idea. I don't want these random fucking ads popping up on my thing. I don't want this to pop up. Okay, we're cropping it. You're not getting my fucking... I don't want to hear it get fucking... Final draft. How about you shut the fuck up? How about that? Okay. <laughs> How do you handle risks uh, you need to take to achieve goals? Okay. Why are ads turned off for this website? I don't act hard, rashly and working together with my friends, we can handle anything. I do what I have to do. I use my brains to minimize risks. I'll take risks, risks to achieve my goals. They're important enough. I will learn how to handle risks well and responsibly by working on myself. Risks? What risks? I'll defeat everybody. I'm the best. Uh, I'll, uh, working together with my team is, is how I do things. What happens when you f uh, fail at something? There is so many ads on this website. What happens when you fail at something that was really important to you? Say, oh well, no big deal. Wait. What happens when you fail at something you that was important to you? Learn from my failures and use that lessons to do something even more awesome. I get upset, but I keep it inside. Get introspective about it. I explode a fit and bad temper. I cry, but then I get back and try again. Okay. I learn from my failure. How do you get along with your friends? I'm extremely loyal and protective. I have no friends, but I respect. Uh, but if I respect you, I'll try to not be too much of a jerk. I have a hard time connecting with people. I have no social skills at all. <laughs> it's not me. I have a perfect pillar. I'm a perfect pillar of emotional support for my friends. I find my friends to be great and a great inspiration for me. I am extremely loyal and protective of my friends. <laughs> I have no social skills at all. Well, if they're my friends, then it's not social skills anymore. It's just bullying. What is the thing that motivates you the most? Proving somebody wrong uh, to deserve the desire to prove the, uh, that I'm the best. My responsibility is success, family, the desire to protect people. Success. Money. Where's money? Money's not an option. I guess success is, is basically money. When everything around you gets crazy, what do you do? I focus and try harder. I, I stay calm and relaxed. What is something that happened? I get crazier. I feel scared, but I work out uh, a way to handle it. A true hero never, um, it, it never is not afraid. Uh, how are your manners? I'm relaxed, friendly, informal, and blunt. I'm rude and crude. You got a problem with that? I'm always- I always try to be respectful. I'm polite, but I always uh, get too excitable sometimes. I'm very formal if distant. I'm usually too distracted. I have very good manners. I think it's that one. Okay. Um... When it comes to playing sports, uh, sports and games, how do you play? 
just try to have fun. I try to win at any cost. I will use every underhanded trick in the book to win. I play fairly, but I'm sneaky. I'll try to help everyone have the best experience. I just try to have fun. What kind of student are you? Uh... I don't even have to try. I take tons and tons of notes and spend countless hours analyzing them. I'm an okay student. I'm okay. How open are you? Back off. I wear a heart on my sleeve. I do not connect well with others. I am very open and friendly person. I work well with everybody. Nobody can get past my defenses. Or else I'll show my claws. How important is family to you? Uh, I care a lot about my family, but it's my friends who I really connect with. If people, if other people had to describe you in just one word, what would that be? Arrogant, friendly, distant, supportive, weird, or analytical? Clown. Clown isn't an option. Pick one. Weird. Pretty much. If you had to describe yourself in just one word, what would that word be? Disciplined, caring, best, in inventive, inventive, lucky, or responsible. Inventive, caring, responsible, lucky, disciplined. I guess disciplined, caring, I care. What is your sense of fashion like? Um, usually it's old fashioned or weird or relaxed. Or sloppy. It's actually all of these. So weird. How do you like to handle abnormal situations? I get scared at first, but quickly become focused and ferocious. I work with my friends to take care of things. I get excited. I melodramatically overreact. I calmly and quietly assess uh, things. I yell at them until they go away. <laughs> get out of my head! Get out of my head! F, I <laughs> melodramatically older overreact. <laughs> uh, uh, how do you handle obstacles? I get clever. I never stop until I win. I analyze them until I find a solution. I use dirty trick and clever idea until I can achieve a victory calmly and rationally. I never stop until I win. Say that there's a big test coming up and you need to do well in it. How do you prepare for it? Um. I don't need to study, I already know it. I get, get help from my family, I obsess over it, I ask friends for help. I study alone, I don't need to do it for long. I review my copious notes over and over again until I understand everything. How do you spend your free time? Um, spend my time training, none of your business. I spend time with family, I spend time with friends, I spend time creating things. I spend time brooding over things alone. How well do you work in teams? I try to be helpful. I don't uh, I don't do teamwork unless I'm forced to. My team is there to help me look good. I have to be on uh, on a team then I'm a leader or if I have to be. I'm very good at forming bonds and working with others. I put my trust in my teammates. Uh Which one, Ina? I'm leaning on this one. Very good at forming bonds and working with others. What's your personality like? <laughs> I'm a little shy. Puts a uh, try. <laughs> puts long um, bangs over eyes. 
I'm sh I'm I'm shy and nervous. I run both hot and cold, level-headed and responsible, bubbly and energetic, manic and quirky. I think I'm manic and quirky. Take the gay test. I'll take it later. How do you want other people to feel around you? Um, happy. How nice are you? Nice, nice. What is, uh, what use is nice? I try to help others when I, when, uh, doing so harms me. Even when doing so harms me. I can be blunt rude sometimes, but I'm always friendly and helpful. I use, uh, being nice as, uh, to get my own way. I always try to be nice and helpful. I don't care about nice. I guess this one. What makes you try to be helpful? Um... I have something to prove. I do it, uh, so everybody will see how awesome I am. I want to help my family. I want to, uh, support people. I want recognition and success. Uh... Uh, this one? How often do you end up in the emergency room? Uh, that's a very strange question. <laughs> Rarely. I play it safe when I can. I have good judgment. I plan things out so nothing has a chance. Sometimes I try to play it safe, but I do... But I do what I have to. That would probably be me. What would you suggest is your biggest problem? I cry too easily, overconfidence, I can be blunt and direct, uh, I don't form personal connections well, I sometimes shrink back inside of step- instead of stepping forward, I can be manipulative, I can be blunt and direct. What do you think a hero should be like? Somebody who isn't a bully, somebody who makes other people feel safe, clever, somebody who serves the people who they care about, a winner, somebody who, who looks after people. How do you inspire others? Uh, others to be their best. Inspire others to make me successful. Inspire others to do the right thing. How disciplined are you? When I set my mind to a task, I finish it no matter what. If I'm awake, I'm hard at work. I eat, live, and breathe self-discipline. I'm not always good at self-discipline, but I'm trying. I, I'm pretty laid back, but I can work when I have to. Probably that one. Which seems like the best advice for achieving success to you. Um, identify your weaknesses and improve them. Do you go with your heart or your head more? My heart is my guide. I go with my head every time. I'm all heart, or I don't think that means I'm stupid. But don't think that means I'm stupid. I'm motivated by heart, but I lead with my brain. Uh, I guess this one. How do you- how impulsive are you? I'm ruled by impulses. I fight my impulses. I'm very impulsive, but uh, also self-disciplined. I guess that one. I got Sue you. That's me, I'm the autistic frog. <laughs> Sue you is a calm, level headed person who always thinks rationally, though she has a warm and caring heart. She makes friends easily despite some sometimes being blunt to the point of rudeness. She supports and helps her friends no matter what. I'm the autistic frog. Okay, it's time to take the gay test, apparently. I don't know why he wants me to take this. And there's fucking ads all over this. Are you happy I'm taking the gay quiz now? The tongue size is all that matters. 
Have you ever had feelings for the same gender close friend? Have you ever kissed someone or wanted to kiss someone of the same gender? How do you feel about queer characters in TV shows and movies? <laughs> no, I'm not. Someone asks you who you're crushing on. Has anyone ever asked you if you were gay? <laughs> Don't lie! Don't lie! <laughs> no, it's, it's definitely this one. <laughs> You're like, like, once or twice, I guess. <laughs> Stop lying. <laughs> On a daily basis. <laughs> Chat, you're here now. You're now here. Not lying. Fine. If it if, if, if is me clicking on this mean that I'm not lying. Okay, so what if I click on this? That's lying? What about what about this one? The top one? Fine. Oh my god. Fine. Can you imagine being in a relationship? What do you picture? I'm not sure. How would you feel about identifying as gay? Uh, that one. Have you ever felt attracted to someone of the same gender? Let's see. How do you feel about... Uh, fantasize about being with someone of the same gender. Um, when you imagine kissing or being intimate with a future partner, how do you feel? Hmm. 
Um... Imagine kissing or being intimate with a future partner. How do you feel? Uh, if you scroll through your feed or FYP. What? Do you see content from queer creators? Maybe. Flash forward five years, how likely is it that your partner is the same gender as you? Would you be comfortable using... Your friend group? No. Make this quiz. Training tips for dog. Um, this is fake. It's fake. I like how the next one on the top is the autism test. <sighs> I don't think I should take the autism test. <laughs> take the autism test, fine. I'll take the one from the UK. this this website actually doesn't even um like oh shoot display display okay this one actually doesn't have ads all over it I guess this is, uh, correct. Okay. Here, let me just, um... Here, I know what to do. Reset transformation. There we go. Okay. Question one, do you prefer to do th Um, I prefer to do things on my own rather than with others. Uh, slightly agree. I prefer doing things the same way. For instance, my morning routine or trip to the supermarket. I guess, I, I mean like, slightly. I find myself becoming strongly absorbed in something, even obsessional, yeah. I'm very sensitive to noise when I hear, wear earplugs to cover, or cover my ears in certain situations. Uh, not, I mean like, certain situations. Are you talking about if it's loud? Yeah? <laughs> yeah, I probably would. Sometimes, um, People say I'm being rude, even though I think I'm being polite. That's happened to me a couple times, slightly. I, th I find it easy to imagine what characters from books might look like. Yeah? I find it easy to talk to uh, talking groups of people. I'm more interested in finding out about things 
than people. I guess. I don't slightly disagree. Find numbers, dates, and strings of information fascinating. No. I prefer nonfiction books and, fi uh, and films to fiction. I guess slightly agree. I find it upsetting if my daily routine is upset or changed. It's difficult for me to understand people's facial expressions and body language. I don't have any problems making small talk with new people. I notice very small changes in a person's appearance. When I was young, I used to play lots of let's pretend or imaginary games. I like collecting information about things I am interested in. I like meeting new people. People close to me say I talk about the same things repeatedly. I find it easy to work out what other people are, what people are thinking or feeling just by looking at their facial expressions. New social situations make me feel anxious. It's important to... Can't go back. Fuck it, whatever. It's important for me to carefully plan my activities I'm going to do. I find it hard to work out uh, what other people's intentions are. I would find it really hard uh, to play imaginary games with children. I guess I'm a good diplomat and can please uh, I'm a good diplomat and can help ease difficult social work situations uh, I, I guess I'm often the last person to understand a joke mm. I like doing things spontaneously if I am interrupted doing something, I find it hard to get back to what I was doing beforehand. I notice patterns in things all the time. What kind of patterns? Sure. I have some very strong interests and get upset if I can't pursue them. Yeah. I can tell someone I am talking to is getting bored. Wait, what? Maybe you might be autistic. The test didn't make sense to you because it, it wouldn't make sense to an autistic person. Legacy, why did you make me take that? And you still owe me child support. See, I told you, this character sucks. and I've been thinking. Maybe we should get back together. <laughs> oh, shit. No, 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 Okay, I have an idea. I have an idea. Let's play a game of Buckshot Roulette, right? And... If I... So, I, I will play endless mode, right? Right? And if I get three wins in endless mode, like, I go through the three, the three levels three times, then we will get back together and be a happy family again. But if I fail, 
If I fail, it's over. You're paying child support, $2,000 a month. And I want that $2,000. So, oops, I might... Wait, 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 wait. Okay, let's do the opposite. Let's do the opposite. No, 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 wait, no, wait. So, let's do the opposite. If I win, we don't get back together and you pay child support. If I lose, we will get back together and be a happy family, unfortunately. Which is the unfortunate part. So, I'm hoping we... I ho I'm hoping I lose. Wait, I'm hoping I win. <laughs> this is your idea? Nuh-uh. This was your idea. All right. The Quaaludes. We got to get rid of the Quaaludes. All right. Please sign the waiver. Okay. By the way, I'm pregnant with your kid again. You're gonna be a father of two. Well, was a father of two. Three blanks and two uh, red. That's not true. I'm Preggers. Damn. Now it's a uh, two one. Ooh. One one. Let's see what he's gonna do. That was a super risky move on his part. That was a super duper risky move. Why'd he do that? This doesn't matter now. Oh, he's gonna change it. Okay. Why didn't he do that before? Okay. I guess he really didn't want to waste it. I don't, I don't know what he was thinking there. I have my Siggies, so free health. I wasn't paying attention. Was it 4 4? I think it was 4 4. I'm going to do this. Check this out. Bazingus, throw that there. Throw it back, Worker B. Okay, we're going to, shit man, we're going to do this, we're just going to shoot him twice and just get it over with. Also, um, if I win, uh, new rules to the rules, if I win, I'm not gay. Yes. The test wasn't even real. Like, the test was like a fakey or something, or fake or whatever. When did we have sex? Well, I'm. I'm a woman. Like, 
a scene. sir good sir okay i'm going to assume this is going to be a blank that's a very big assumption for me considering the results careful now well i know for a fact that oh shit okay this is bad So that is a live round. Okay. I have to either win or lose. Okay. He can't do anything other than shoot me once with a blank. That's all he can do. He, he can he can shoot me once by changing it to a blank. And then that's it. So he can still heal. So he's going to lock me up. He's going to then change one, the blank into a real one and that's all he can do that's all he can do and then it's pretty much just blinks for the rest of them so we're ba pretty much he he's he's on top of this one right now this is quite unfortunate of an rng situation all right well i'm free now so, let's see. I need a health item or something that where I can take his health item. I don't think the game's gonna give me that. No, it's not gonna give me that. So I'm gonna have to take his, yeah. Okay, I'm gonna have to take his two blanks and one actual round. So what I'm gonna have to do is I'm gonna have to chain him up. I have to. Okay. We have to do this in one go. I'm going to take this. Wait, oh, why did I do that? I didn't mean to take use that. Oh, well, okay. Uh that, that was a that was a mistake. I didn't mean to do that. Well, I guess it works out for us. I'm an idiot. The shot- oh, I am an idiot. <laughs> I'm an idiot because I changed the live round to be a, uh, I could have ended it. I could have ended it. <laughs> three- three live, three blanks. I could have ended it. I fucked up. I fucked up. <laughs> Oh, no. Go ahead and wear that for me, please. Okay. If this is not alive, okay. We're fucked. This is, it's over. Okay, so there's three live and two blanks now. I'm going to take a huge assumption. A huge, huge. Also, my character's thing's broken. My face is broken. Okay, we're good. I'm going to take a huge. Ah, oh, you fucking, you dog. You dog. It's over. Okay, you know what? Fuck it. I don't have another. I hate you, game.
Um, okay, how about double or nothing? Come on, Legacy. Double or nothing. You know I'm good for it. If, okay, how about this instead? For the double or nothing, I'll get an abortion. Okay? If I lose. Plus, we get back together. Okay? Deal. But if I win, double the... So, double the, uh... Double the child support. So, $4,000 a month. So you already said deal, so you already knew the terms when I said double or nothing. By the way, I'm I'm putting the, the name of the person here of the liability. I'm naming it after our first kid. Minecraft Jenny mod. <laughs> One f strong, the other. Okay, let me see here. I have an idea. <laughs> I've been hydrating. Three blanks, two live. Okay. Three blanks and two live. Remember, I have to double or nothing three times for me to win, okay? So you have- I'm literally, um, handicapping myself. Three live, three blanks. Okay. Three live, three blanks. Let's see. Where's the phone say? Both shells are blank. chug this one Let's see what this was that was a live round okay I have an idea just a massive assumption huge assumption actually massive huge assumption but this would give me a play it worked it fucking worked 
What can I say except he's gonna use his adrenaline to heal himself. I don't remember the numbers, by the way, so I'm screwed. But he's gonna use the adrenaline, I think. The fourth shell is a blank. That was the second shell. So one was live, one was blank. I changed the blank into a live, so there's still two live, two blank. That's a th the third blank. So he's gonna use that to heal, and he's going to hit me with a live round, which means that there's only, I think, one blank left. And I think there's still, there's still two live rounds, like actual live rounds. That's the third one, so the fourth one is a blank. We know this. The fourth one is in fact a blank. This is a blank. Yeah. So that means that this next one is going to be a live round. Now we're on even terms. I think the next round in here is also a live round, so I think he's still going to have an advantage on me, unfortunately. Yeah. Careful now. And I think that was the last round in the gun. Yeah. Okay. Let's see if we can get some healing here. Hmm. Two live, three blank. Okay. Two live and three blank. Here's how we're gonna play this one. We're going to handcuff him. Okay. We're going to check this. It's a blank. So what we're going to do is we're going to change it. Okay. So this is now a live round. Okay. We're going to see what this next one is. Because we can still work with this. Check this out. We have all the plays that we can possibly have to win this. We're going to take this magnifying glass. We're going to see what it is. It is a blank round. So instead we're going to take some more adrenaline. To then change it into an actual live round. And now this will be a live round and we'll win this round. Like so. This game is actually more like a puzzle game than, um, if anything, and, and of course there's some- there's a bit of chance there as well. But if you play your cards right, it's possible for you to come out on top. Three health on this one, two blanks, two live. Very much possible. Okay, so he can actually get- he actually gets a chance to see what it is. What sucks is that I have no way of knowing because it's two blanks and two lives, so it's a 50-50 chance. Pretty much a 50-50 chance. So, what I have to do is just risk it and hope that this round is going to be a live round. And if it is, then we will do double damage, then the next one will most likely be a blank round, and in that case, we can just shoot at him with it. Okay. This next one should hopefully be a- it's more likely to be a blank round than it is a live round. So we're just going to have to chance it with this one, and just assume that it is a blank round, change it to a live round, and then shoot him again. No, it was a, it was the only other live round, which means he can't do anything to me. He can't do anything else to me. They're both blank rounds. Yeah, this next one's a blank round. So he gets to live another day. One live, one blank. We can work with this because we get to go first. Second shell is a live round, which means 
so we don't even have to go overboard. We can just do this. I'm not even going to waste my um, item on you. Okay. First double or nothing. Done. Two live, two blank. Okay. Chain them up. Okay. That was a live, so there's one more live. Let's assume this is a live round. It is. We could have doubled down on that. Oh, nice. Okay. He has full everything. Oh my god, four live, four blank. Okay. I think that's eight bullets. Eight bullets and a dream, my friend. Eight bullets and a dream. Let's see. to capitalize on this as best as we can. Okay. He has so much stuff to fuck me over with, too. Which is the unfortunate part. Alright. And now... There's three blank, four live. Higher chance of this being an actual bull. Yep. two blanks, okay? Go ahead and take this for me, my friend. We can easily snuff this guy out here. It's a blank, okay. We'll just take it while we can. Alright, and now all he has is a live bullet or a blank, which he's going to transfer into a. He's going to heal one, so that just completely negates one of my attacks, and he's going to try to heal. Let's hope that he fails. Let's see. He did. He got it. So he's back to full health, so it didn't even matter. And he's going to break that and make it a life round, so I lose. Oh, shit. And it's two damage, too, on top of that. This is very unfortunate for me. I mean, to be fair, the only thing, other thing I could have done in that situation was to just make all of them blank. But I would have had to have the hindsight of knowing all, like, before that it was a blank in the first place. I would have had to have that hindsight, which I didn't. Okay, so here's what I'm going to do. I'm going to do what he did. 
three live four blank. So I'm going to take this. And I'm going to take this and see if I die. I did not. Okay. Six shell is a live round. That's not really that helpful because of how far away that is. Okay. Blank round. Probably another blank round. Let's make it even. So, well, let's make it more likely to be a live round. Okay, that was one of the few live rounds in there. Let's see. He got lucky. He got lucky. Well, now it's even, I think. Let's hope he's going to be able to change it regardless. So I'm screwed here. It's a live round. <laughs> Great. He didn't even have to waste it. That means the last couple of them are going to be, uh, well, there's actually one more live round, which is unfortunate. Uh, Uh, fuck it. We ballin'. This is quite unfortunate. Quite unfortunate indeed. Three live, three blanks. Well, have a choice. Well. <sighs> I don't think he's here, so I don't think he saw that. Let's just pretend that he didn't see that. So, don't nobody tell him that I, I'm not getting the abortion. Don't tell him. Don't tell him. No. Um, I gotta go, I gotta go cry for, for two hours. Uh, something just came up.